Now I will discuss about the global constraints. In Laravel, you can define the global constraints that are applied to all the routes in your application. Global constraints allow you to restrict the values that are passed to a routes parameter. I am going to show you an example so that you will understand. Global constraints actually are useful when you need to ensure that certain parameters in your routes are within a specific range or formats. In order to use the global constraints, what I will need to do? First, I will have to go the app folder, then you will have to go the providers folder and here you see that route service provider.php just open that in the route service provider here you see that there is a boot function in the boot function i am going to write my codes and here i will use the route pattern okay so here the first one is id and second one that i already used in the case of regular expression constraints you already know that so i am going to use like that why i am writing this into the route service provider because i want that where i will use the id as the global parameter in all the cases for all the routes this will work not any specific route in the web.php now wherever you want to use the id as the parameter in every cases that will work i am going to show you this i am going to create here and about and here or here i can give a student and here for example this is id then what it will do where i am going to use the student id here for example i give id uh, here this is not actually important look a student id okay now i am going to run this that is a student id id means here i give 23 you see that there is no error message but if you give another one you see that there is a 404 not found why it is coming this 404 is coming for any alphabet because this id is now working what it worked in the case of regular expression in the similar way it is working here because I did not write anything here in using the wire but in the route service provider I define the pattern for ID so in all the routes for example I have another route that does the similar thing that is teacher ID okay so here in this ID it will also work so now instead of a student if I give here the teacher you see that there is 404 not working but if i give any number it is working well that means for each individual route i do not need to specify the condition so this is the advantage because i define this in global way so i write this code only one time and it will work for all the routes in my application i hope you have understood